the honey badger, a creature so fearless that it fights lions, shrugs off snake venom, and will rip into anything that dares cross its path. The wolverine, a relentless bone crusher, taking down prey many times its size. These animals are infamous for their ferocity. But what if I told you their ancestor was even deadlier? This is Aomelivora, a monstrous, hypercarnivorous predator. Bigger than a wolverine, stronger than a honey badger, and one of the most terrifying mustelids to ever walk the earth. A creature so powerful and dominant that it ruled entire continents. But today, it has been forgotten, lost to time, until now. Aomelivora wasn't just one species. It was an entire genus of super predators, thriving during the late Miocene, between 11 to 5 million years ago. Fossils of these beasts have been uncovered across Eurasia, North America, and possibly even Africa, but not all Aomelivora were the same. From China to France, from Hungary to Africa, these monstrous mustelids were among the most fearsome hunters of their time. But what made them so unstoppable? Unlike modern badgers and wolverines, which eat whatever they can find, Aomelivora was a true hypercarnivore, meaning its diet consisted of at least 75% pure meat. Its massive canines and bone-crushing molars allowed it to rip apart prey and devour even the toughest bones. But it wasn't just its teeth that made it deadly. Aomelivora was built for power. Unlike the stocky honey badger, it had long, muscular limbs, allowing it to chase down prey across open landscapes. In many ways, it was a mustelid that thought it was a big cat. But even for a top predator, survival in the Miocene was no easy task. There were bigger, stronger carnivores lurking in the shadows. Aomelivora ruled the Miocene, but it wasn't alone. It shared its world with some of the most terrifying predators to ever exist. Such as Barbarophilus, Amphicionids, Machaerodontinae, and also there were giant hyenas. Competition was fierce, and survival meant adapting or dying. But Aomelivora had one trick up its sleeve. It could live everywhere. From Europe's forests to the open plains of Asia, even down into Africa, it thrived, until it didn't. So, what killed off this prehistoric titan? The answer lies in the very world it once ruled. As the Miocene came to an end, the earth was changing, forests disappeared, prey populations declined, and more advanced predators, the true saber-toothed cats and massive bears, began to dominate. By the time the Pliocene arrived, Aomelivora was gone, its kind replaced by smaller, more adaptable mustelids, like the ancestors of the honey badger and wolverine, but its legacy lives on. The fearlessness of the honey badger, the strength of the wolverine, these modern mustelids are all that remain of a bloodline that once dominated the world. Aomelivora was a beast like no other, but it wasn't the only prehistoric enigma. If you think this was fascinating, you need to hear about Atopodentatus, the prehistoric reptile with a hammerhead that confused scientists for years. Click the video on screen now. And let's unravel another prehistoric mystery.